Alright, so we're back here. Saw something like this back in the war. Transmitters. Militech was using them. Short range UHF. Signal only travels line of sight, but it can't be intercepted. Line of sight? Let's look around, see if we can't spot where our receiver is camping out. Yes, before we do that, though, I'm gonna keep examining the apartment. Because I want to see if there's anything else to find in here. This is them talking about me. nothing out there as far as we can tell yeah, it looks like every one of these uh, screens are screwed We'll just uh, take a bit of cash from them. Looks like SSI's employees knew about the break-in. Mm-hmm.
that's and that's where that is. Okay, so found everything that we're going to find here. As far as I can tell. Bullet holes. Cocked up. grab a bike because otherwise I'm not going to be able to keep up with this uh, this van that we started chasing the other day What's up, dickheads? What the hell? Neutralize the target! Ow! Okay, let's... Let's not do that. Oh boy. I'm using a bike is because it's A, it's fast, and B, it. Yeah, I can weave through traffic with it.
only I could s drive straight without people getting in my way. That'd be great. Fuck is it going? Oh, for the love of Christ. Gotcha, you son of a bitch. Haha. Oh shit, there's a lot more of them. Okay. All right, this one's not doing as good a job, so. Good for you, I don't care. Actually... Eat shit. Goodbye. Anyone else? Oh boy, more. Please, by all means, stand next to the explosives.
even get him in there? Yes, I can. Well then. And then there's two jokers in there. <laughs> ha! Oh, that's amazing that I could do that. I could've stealth this, really, but... Fuck it. Or should you? Goodbye. You pieces of shit. So they literally called them to come and kill us. I can stash them in the trunk of the car. My bike. Oh shit. His hair dye. Huh. <coughs> but yeah, I guess after. After you do the shipping and thing, you have a silver arm thing that you can put on. Pictures, medical records. Vulnerability to neuroplasticity. It's some kind of database. Yep, they've been brainwashing them. The paralysis, biological casts, neuroplasticity. Fuck. What about that? The blue shit. Fresh neural links. They're not spying on them, Johnny. They're fucking with their heads. Yeah. You mean to say someone's literally controlling our upstanding politicians' minds? Apparently. Huh? Red blots are memory resonating <coughs> in this region. See how they're bleeding into the blue? So what are we looking at? They're planting new memories in their heads, modifying their personalities. Oh, this is big shit, Johnny. Oh, son of Fuck a bitch. Me. Yeah, Got other you said it. Pigs besides the paralysis, too. Quick, download the data. Whoever comes looking for it, that's your suspect. Shit! They're wiping the data! We've been made. Now they know someone's been in their database. Wonder if they also know who. Hmm. Ah, oh boy. Watch him not even remember this. V, do you have any news? Gonna want to sit down for this. It's it's way bigger than we thought. Mm -hmm. is, you're being brainwashed, literally. They've scanned your minds and now using some kind of conditioning to wait. 
Not on the hollow. Right. I'll come back. <coughs> you and I, we need to speak alone. Uh. I know a little ramen place in Japantown. Sending you the coordinates. Right. See you there. Well, all is well that ends well, I guess. Oh, it's this place. Been here before. Hello. Will you say thank you for coming? Cozy little joint. Doesn't really match your style, though. But it's perfect for a one on one. Here we are, then. What is it? I... I'm sorry. My nerves are shot. I can't gather my thoughts. Wasn't that long ago we last met. Something happened since then? No. I mean, something did happen, though not recently. Uh-huh. It's a long story. I don't quite know how to tell you. Where to even start? Relax. No need to rush. Ah, <sighs> uh, a, a while ago, I started noticing some changes in Jeff's behavior. Well, you're literally being His brainwashed, so personality. He seemed to be changing right in front of me, becoming someone else. How so? Right through the screens. He stopped reading, forgot the title of his favorite movie, even his musical taste changed overnight. Hmm. Once, I said we should visit his brother's grave, and he told me that he'd been an only child. That's when I started thinking something bad was happening. Something... insidious. And not just with Jeff. Notice any changes in yourself? Mm-hmm. After some time, on several occasions, my friends pointed out that I was acting strangely. Well, that must have been hard. It was. You know, it, it's at times like those you start to question reality. So the whole time you knew what I could end up finding. You lot are being brainwashed. I don't know how or why, but they are changing us. That concealed room in our apartment. What about it? I'm sure I'd seen it before, but must have somehow forgotten. Oh, lovely. Yeah, that seems to be a very. I find that terrifying. You fucking should, because trust me, I'm going through. It's like this character's going through basically the opposite. Mentioned any of this to Just the extreme of that. I tried. I did. But he's blinded to everything. He just laughed. Said I was imagining things. Yep, he's fucked. He once brought up a vacation that we never went on. Swear to God. He went on about it in such detail. I almost started believing him. Could be just you who forgot. Maybe they just wiped the trip from your memory. Hell, I don't know anymore. Don't you get that? Yeah, that's kind of, uh... Haven't told me the whole story this, yet. Nah, yeah, this whole situation's kind of fucked. I saw a stranger in our apartment one night tinkering with the monitors. But I was in such a state by then that I didn't know if I could trust my own eyes. Yeah. So, you didn't do anything? You can't trust your own mind. What happened. I talked to security the next morning. Yeah, when you can't trust your own mind, that's pretty much when you start going nuts. Find it strange you took this to security instead of your husband. I thought I was going insane. Yep. I wanted to see what was on the feeds first. There was nothing there, of course, so what was I supposed to tell Jeff? They wiped the footage. And then, the next day, I got a call. 
Who was it? Them. Whoever they are. There was a garbled voice on the other end. He never introduced himself. They threaten you? Try to blackmail you? They said I was walking on thin ice. That if we kept stirring up trouble, Jeff could have an accident. Then they wiped any record of our conversation. It was as if it had never happened. So I'm begging you, V. Jefferson can't find out about any of this. Ever. Right. His life depends on it. You knew who sent the intruder, but just strung me along anyway, Liz? Yeah, it's like... I didn't have a choice. I didn't know what to do. Wanted everything to just go on and flow on, because it was convenient. Convenient? Uh, that's why I, so I hate politics. Life. Prominent husband. You don't lack for a thing. You think I'm having fun? You have no idea what it's like living like this. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Trust me. You're just saying what they programmed you to say. Hey, mate. Just reading off a script based on thoughts planted in your head. All I know is I love my husband and I want him to be safe and and happy. Or that's what they want you to know. You know what Jeff will do if you tell him? I know my husband. He'll start looking on his own. He can't find out about this. It... It's destroy him. Oh yeah, we'll just... But damn it, Elizabeth. You gonna ignore this? Somebody poking around in your heads. Exactly. What choice do I have? To get myself killed? <clears throat> or see my husband dragged away from me? Asking me to lie to my employer? I'm going to tell Jeff that SSI was spying for his rival, Holt. You just need to confirm what I say. And if I'm not on board? You have a choice. Just remember, any consequences will not be yours to deal with. Yeah, I mean, I don't really like you guys, so... Truly prepared to fire SSI? After the threats? It'd be brave, but risky as all get out. What they're doing to us is one thing. But when you found that concealed room, I can't accept strangers spying on us while we sleep. Not under my own roof. Mm, what should difference you? does it make where? I'll take full responsibility for anything SSI goes on to do. I'm just asking you not to get Jefferson involved. Mm. I'll add a meeting in Reconciliation Park to Jeff's schedule. He'll be waiting. Since I can't know if I'll remember this conversation tomorrow, I'm counting on you not to forget what I asked of you. I won't. But that's all I can promise. Goodbye, V. Mm-hmm. I mean, quite frankly, I don't like you, Old so... Things fucked up, huh? Wouldn't want to be in her pants. Mm -hmm. Speaking of... Overlapping memories, changing personalities... Remind you of anything? Yeah. But hey, at least we know what we're up against. No. no, this is different. Saw yourself. They're purposely modifying their minds, individual thoughts. Mm hmm. Paralysis make a damn nice next gen puppet. Even in my day, there were whispers about this kind of stuff cognitive pattern fluctuators, remote neural re networking. In layman's terms, gaslighting. The beauty is that everything's fair game. Subliminal TV signals, high density emitters, and your electric toothbrush. You name it. And you so, would have done what? In my pants, what would you do? Some real rat bastards behind this. Someone's got to take them down. Yeah, I know, right? Why don't they just. Risking the Paralysis lives? Fuck knows what kind of shit a mayor controlled by puppet masters could pull. Yep. But yeah, you could end up putting their lives at risk. Or not. Tough choice, V. I mean, I could just decide to say I looked into it myself and they like, because I can just go and find these guys wherever the hell they are and kick their asses. Yeah, I don't really take too kindly to blackmail.
Hello, V. Jeff. Need to talk. Yes, I know. Elizabeth filled me in. Did she now? Sounds like I was right to hire a professional. Elizabeth, what did she tell you exactly? Didn't get specific. Just that SSI was spying for that son of a bitch Holt. Guess you got more though. <sighs> Fuck it. SSI wasn't working for Holt. You're in deeper shit than you think. Meaning? They're in your heads, Jefferson. Yours and Elizabeth's. This some kind of chuckle-worthy metaphor? No, oh, I fucking dreams, wish. Partial recall, jumbled memories. It's not just stress and long hours. I don't know what you're trying to tell me, but I don't think I like where this is headed. Nor should you. Wake up. Your brain's a mess. Messier than the discount section of a beady smut hut. I'm not paying you to make up riddles for me, so get to the point. SSI's on the take of some unknown group that's out to control your lives. Know there's a concealed room in your pad? Out with it. They've got tech in there you wouldn't believe. These people know everything about you and your wife, watching your every move. <sighs> Somebody's programming you and your life. Yep. Sounds like something out of the movies. Yes, it does. Saw your brain scans. They're tweaking your neural connections. This ain't no movie, Jeff. Been at it for a while with you and Liz. Editing your memories, your tastes, your views and beliefs, even. Congratulations. I not have known about this. You're being brainwashed because you're being paid, memories, made to forget. Can't even trust those anymore. That's true. I'll never know what's real in my life and what's a lie, fabricated. Yep. Wait, the intruder. I have to find him. Got no idea how we go about doing that. First, I'll find him. Then I'll find whoever's behind this. Pull the curtain back on these motherfuckers and show them what's what. Could show their hand if you're patient. Wait long enough. Or use your mayoral powers if you get elected. As long as you don't forget all this by morning. Sun Tzu's art of war. Feign weakness, so your enemy may grow arrogant. Hmm. Don't see you doing much feigning, Jeff. My god. I have to tell Liz! Your wife knows everything. Liz? How? Because I fucking it told her. At some point? Elizabeth? No, 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 no. She would have said something. She feared for your life, your daughter's life. Who could blame her? No. Nah. She's never kept anything from me. And she doesn't scare easily, believe me. Got an anonymous hollow telling her to keep her mouth shut. So she did what the perfect candidate's wife would do. Protected her family. I won't let them get away with this. Nor should you, mate. Honestly, I'd fucking take him out myself if I knew where to get him. Already, v. All that's left to do is wait. All right. Well. So what now? Still want to be mayor? Well, I'm not about to give up. I didn't run just to. Uh, I'll wait for my window, an opportunity, then make my move. Isn't that exactly what they want? Well, I'll give them more than they bargained for. The same with the Aredis. Take care, V. Good luck. Yeah, you're uh, gonna fucking need it. Night. So, thoughts? Hmm, somehow I doubt it's people who are behind this. So yeah. aliens. <laughs> Very funny. You're too young to remember this, but not so long ago, people talked about rogue AIs prowling cyberspace. 
What the so... fuck would an AI want with this shit? Doesn't matter who. What matters is that guy decided to take up the gauntlet. My man. Yep. 